We have two inpatient wards here at the Alfred, one on the first floor and one on the ground floor. Both wards have both a low dependency unit or LDU and a HDU or high dependency unit. Consumers, when they're first admitted to the HDU, tend to be in a more acute phase of their illness and require a higher level of care by nursing staff. Once their care progresses and, they, and their mental state starts to improve, we can begin to transition them to the low dependency area. The low dependency unit has a lounge area and some private spaces for people to spend time, a dining and, and common areas where people can engage in games, art therapy rooms, and they have access to a courtyard where there is um, really nice green quiet spaces for people to spend time. We do have single bedrooms and shared bedrooms all accessible by a special wristband. We've got some rooms that are shared and we try and make sure that it's shared with someone that's compatible with the person. So we will always consider same sex or same gendered rooms. We also have an area in on each ward that is gender sensitive. So what we mean by that is we will consider not only the gender but also what gender that person considers themselves to be. Um, we also have some rooms that are single rooms and often we will consider those rooms especially for those that are particularly unwell or needing to be in a place where they feel safe on their own. The average length of stay usually is 10 to 14 days. Depending on how unwell someone is, sometimes that can be shorter and sometimes that can be for a longer period. So we try and treat people to a point of them being ready to be discharged into the community. Sometimes just being in hospital is really helpful for improving people's mental state. Um, even before we even get to medications, like just being supported by the nursing staff and the doctors, having people around at all times that you're able to talk to, and even just being able to sleep in a safe space um, every night and feeling secure in that way can be really helpful for people's mental health. We do take into consideration that um, other people need specialised services and so we have what we call our AOD um, team, alcohol and other drugs team and um, there are specific team who come and provide support. We provide nicotine replacement therapy in various forms. We've got a patch, we've also got the inhalers and we've also got the sprays. So you will see a pharmacist um, who are, who's able to talk you through that and we can also refer you to our smoking cessation clinic. Also in the inpatient unit we have what's called the ward robe which is accessible by all consumers. Most of the time people don't want to wear hospital pyjamas, it makes them feel more unwell in a sense and so having put on you know casual clothing, your own clothes that you get to keep, um, I think really helps with people's mental health.